Disability Channel. I'm Jay Stoyne. We're here at the Rico Center, courtesy of Coca-Cola, the Marleys, and of course, Easter Seals Canada. I'm here with the CEO of Easter Seals Canada, Dave Sterrett. Dave, okay. thanks for being uh, on the show today. Hey, my pleasure. Really appreciate the opportunity for inviting us here in the box. What a wonderful day. What a wonderful organization. Dave, why don't you tell us just an overview about the organization that we can get into. Okay. Well, Easter Seal started uh, in 1922, so we're coming up on our 100 year anniversary in a couple of years, starting to work on that. It was started by a group of Rotarians uh, in 1922, and it was to help children at that time living with disabilities, trying to make their lives a little bit easier, providing them back in that, in that day was more about uh, mobility and providing wheelchairs, uh, crutches, and canes. That's how it started out. Of course, now it's uh, what we know it today, and there's many, many programs programs that we have right across this country. Can we talk a little bit about your camps and recreation programs, just generically, not too obviously detailed? Sure. We have 13 camps across the country, um, so there's there's more than one in certain provinces. Uh, the idea is to have children who live with disabilities um, and have issues with uh, accessibility, issues maybe with financial means to be able to attend camps. So we provide that financial means for them to attend camps 10 days out of every summer. Uh, we provide them with with uh, mobility, with wheelchairs, we fly them to swimming pools so they can learn how to swim. We have camps with uh, climbing walls, we have drama programs, we have art programs, uh, we have weight rooms, so it's it's really all encompassing. And I guess people can find out more information obviously on the website. Absolutely, the Easter Seals Canada website or any of our provincial websites as well. We'll be able to tell them all about the Now, again, we're here with the CEO of Easter Seals Canada, Dave Sterrett. Now, Dave, Tell me your personal opinion on how things are improving in society over the last couple of years regarding our communities. Well, I personally have been involved uh, in charities, charitable work probably for about the last 25 years here in the Toronto area. Uh, my family and myself uh, were uh, involved with making sure that uh, abused women, uh, children of abused uh, women, uh, got the food, got the housing that they required. That was my first foray, I suppose, uh, into the charitable world. Uh, when the Easter Seals opportunity came up, uh, I jumped at it. And that was uh, about four years ago, a little over four years ago. And back in that time, uh, it was very competitive. I found the, the uh, landscape very competitive. Our uh, charities didn't seem to want to share. It looked like it was, we're all fighting for the same dollar from the same resources. But I've noticed in the last four plus years that there's a lot more collaboration going on now between charities uh, in the country, not just in the Toronto marketplace where we do a lot of our work here, uh, but right across the country. So there's a lot of collaboration going on. That's great to hear. That, you know, our community definitely needs the support. Exactly. Very good. And Dave, last question. If people want to get involved in Easter Seals, where do they go? How do they do it? Uh, again, the best way to do that is to check out the website, Easter Seals Canada, uh, and, or any of our provincial members as well, Easter Seals by the provincial name. Um, and that'll talk about opportunities, whether it's volunteering, whether it's fundraising efforts, uh, all of those sorts of things will be on our website. And it also talks about all the programs that we offer. They do vary from province to province. There are there are certain uh, um, platforms that everybody, uh, all the all the uh, Easter Seals offices operate on. But then there are independent ones as well, depending on the uniqueness and the opportunities that exist with each individual province in their market. Well, that's great, Dave. I really appreciate the opportunity today. Thank you so much for having the Disability Channel inside the Coca-Cola private box, courtesy of the Rico Center and Easter Seals Canada. I'm Jay Stoyne reporting for the Disability Channel. We'll catch you next time.